good morning friends now we will do on some uh, solve the equation x square 4 minus 2x cube plus 4x square plus 6x minus 21 equal to 0 given that two of its roots are equal so this is power 4 so we have four roots out of four two of the roots are equal in magnitude but they are in opposite side two roots are equal and opposite so now we solve this now this equation is x power 4 minus 2 x cube plus 4 x square plus 6 x minus 21 equal to 0. Let, let the roots be let the roots be alpha, beta, gamma and delta. So these are the four roots. But here according to the given condition, two roots are alpha now we take alpha and beta they are equal but in opposite side alpha equal to minus beta so alpha plus beta equal to zero so this is we take one condition now we use this equator now from this equation now we take it as alpha plus beta plus gamma plus delta sum of the four root is so this is plus minus plus minus plus so minus b by a that is minus or minus mm, 2 this is 2 because so we have a x square sorry a x power 4 plus b x cube plus c x square plus d x plus e equal to 0 in this case sum of the roots so 1 at a time 1 at a time is minus b by a just two at a time is c by a just three three at a time is minus d by a four is minus sorry plus e by a so this is plus minus plus minus plus so so this is one at a time two at a time three at a time and four at a time so according this now we take it as alpha plus beta plus gamma plus delta equal to 2. Just alpha beta plus alpha gamma plus alpha delta plus beta gamma plus beta delta. Next gamma delta this is equal to 4 this is equal to 4 next to 3 at a time alpha beta gamma plus alpha beta delta plus alpha gamma delta plus beta gamma delta this is 3 at a time this is minus 6 minus 6 next all the 4 alpha beta gamma delta this is equal to minus 21 so these are the 4 relations so 1 this is 2 and this is 3 and this is 4 so now this is alpha plus beta equal to 0 so now we apply this alpha plus beta here we apply this this is 0 so gamma plus delta equal to 2 this is because of the given condition so now we take it this is as pi so gamma plus delta because this alpha plus beta we apply here this is 0 so gamma plus delta is 2 just from here from uh, sum 2 uh, sorry equation 2 so we take here we take alpha plus beta we want to take common outside so for that first we take uh, alpha alpha you take uh, say from here alpha you take this is now delta delta plus gamma delta plus gamma this one if you take the gamma plus delta gamma plus delta uh, next we take 
beta will take a common outside beta will take common outside here this is this gamma plus delta gamma plus delta so remaining one to uh, alpha beta plus gamma delta equal to 4 yes so this is alpha plus delta alpha plus delta sorry gamma plus delta gamma plus delta common outside so we have alpha plus beta plus alpha beta plus gamma delta equal to 4 but this is alpha plus beta is 0 so this is now we have this is 0 means in this first time is 0 so we have alpha beta plus gamma delta equal to 4 so we take it this as uh, one number we take it as 4 6 alpha beta plus gamma delta is 4 next we from from this one from third we take it as so we have to take alpha beta gamma not same this alpha beta gamma alpha beta outside we have gamma plus delta gamma plus delta here we have gamma delta outside gamma delta outside we have alpha plus beta so this is minus 6 this is minus 6 so here gamma plus alpha plus beta is so 0 alpha, so this is 0 will come so alpha beta into gamma plus delta we get alpha beta into gamma plus delta we get this is minus 6 this is minus 6 yes say so now alpha, alpha plus B, alpha beta and gamma delta is minus 6 so uh, gamma plus delta we have 2 gamma plus delta we have 2 so we already we found out this we apply here now so alpha beta equal to uh, alpha beta into 2 equal to minus 6 so alpha beta equal to divided by 2 we have minus 3 this is from 5 this is from 5 so now we have alpha beta is minus 3 we found out yes but alpha equal to minus beta or beta equal to minus alpha both same so this beta is replaced by it minus alpha equal to minus 3 so alpha and alpha alpha square this minus this minus cancel so alpha square is 3 now alpha equal to plus or minus square root 3 alpha is plus or minus square root 3 say beta also minus or plus root 3 Are both are same alpha and beta are both same value plus or minus square root 3 so now we apply this value now from using this 6 from using 6 alpha beta plus gamma delta equal to 4 alpha beta is root 3 root 3 alpha is square root 3 beta square root 3 if you product this this is 3 equal to so 3 minus 3 will come because plus or minus so if you take one is plus another one is minus or one is minus another one is plus uh, gamma delta equal to 4 so gamma delta equal to the minus 3 is this is plus 3 so this is 7 at the same time gamma plus delta is so we solve these two we solve these two we find out gamma and delta here this is so we make even quadrant equations sum is to product is 7 so x square minus sum into x plus product equal to 0 x square minus sum sum is 2x product is 7 equal to 
zero. So now we solve this. X equal to minus b. The formula is x equal to minus b plus or minus square root b square minus 4ac by 2a. This is the formula. Minus b minus here minus b is minus 2. So 2 plus or minus square root 2 square is 4 minus 4 into 1 into 7. So minus 28 by 2 into 1. So that is 2. So 4 minus 28 is minus 24. So this is 2 plus or minus minus 24 by 2. This is 2 plus or minus. This is 6 4 or 24. So the square root 4 is 2. We take it inside minus 6 by 2. So we take 2 and cancel out. Cancel. So we get 1 plus or minus square root minus 6. So the roots are the roots are so here first two what alpha beta is square root 3 minus square root 3 and 1 plus square root minus 6 1 minus square root minus 6 so these are the four roots yes so this is one sum This is the one fourth degree equation. So we have four roots. The four roots we take alpha, beta, gamma, delta. But here is one condition is given. After two roots, one per, uh, al, equal in equal in magnitude and opposite sign. That is number is same, but sign is uh, change. So plus alpha equal to minus beta. So alpha equal to minus beta. So this is the given condition according to this we take it as so minus beta this is plus beta. So, so this is given condition alpha plus beta equal to zero. So this is the four things. So sum of the roots one at a time, two at a time, three at a time, and four at a time. So this is first one uh, two and this is four and minus six and uh, here is sum itself minus so minus twenty one. Yes, this is the four condition. Now alpha plus beta equals 0 means this is the remaining true. Gamma plus delta equal to 2. Gamma plus delta equal to 2. Now just we simplify this. Here after simplify we have this line. Here alpha plus beta is 0. So remaining we have alpha beta plus gamma delta equal to 4. Now we take it this as 6. Now this one. Again, this one something we take it common outside. So after that, we get this is alpha plus beta is zero. We get alpha beta and gamma plus delta. Yes, gamma plus delta already we find out two. So this two we apply here. Alpha beta equal to this is two equal to minus six divided by two divided by two. Alpha beta is minus three. So beta itself minus alpha alpha and alpha alpha square so same way beta also we find out what is the value for alpha the same value but opposite sign is for beta so alpha is plus 3 means beta is minus 3 okay. so now uh, this is alpha beta plus gamma delta alpha beta plus gamma delta this equation this is alpha beta plus gamma delta is this one this is from 6 from 6 so alpha beta together we apply here root 3 into root 3 3 will come but plus into minus minus so now we get uh, gamma theta is 7 and alpha plus gamma plus delta is 2 this is sum of the root 2 roots product of the same 2 roots so this is form the quadratic equation we, using the formula we solve and we find out the 4 roots thank you for watching this video